Holy Angels, because of its caringness and its caring community, is an excellent place for all of our parents to consider sending their students to. The greatest thing we have to offer is the uniqueness of every individual, but the collective identity of the school, the community. My favorite part is the community. Whenever I walk in the hallways, everyone knows who I am. They always say hi to me, or smile at least, and it just makes my day seeing everyone every day. Everybody belongs here. I mean, you're here, and people want you here, and they want to see your face, and they want to get to know you. I really like the community. Um, in fact, my son, right when he transferred, he said, I'm so glad I have, we have a couple extra minutes to transfer between classes he, because he said everyone says hello to each other and so you need that time to, you know, say hi in the halls and, and that was really great to know that instantly um, he and we felt like we belonged at the school. It's a very inclusive place and I think that there are a lot of different people from a lot of different backgrounds and that makes it really fun to get to know different people. Holy Angels uh, has a very rich academic program that's rigorous uh, for students of all levels. It's particularly rigorous in the advanced placement cor courses. We offer uh, annually between 17 and 19 classes for students uh, and they're able to test in many more areas beyond that. You're going to be pushed academically and you know you're going to grow from that experience here, become a more intelligent, bright young person. Not just learning math because we have to learn math, but learning math because if you want to be in business, this is the kind of math you're going to do. You're going to get a fantastic world-class education at Holy Angels. Our teachers are phenomenal. I think that all the teachers are really dedicated to their work and they're willing to help you and teach you what you need to know. Your students will work with teachers every day that know their names and care about them. I don't know how to thank them because sometimes you are really struggling and they, they can see that and when they see that they tell you like, hey, you want to come and check in with me? And even if it's not that you're struggling with a school issue, maybe it's like a home issue, they are always there to talk and always there to help you. The salary and it's either this or this. Here at Holy Angels we realized that STEM is a very important thing and we want to encourage more students to pursue science, technology, engineering, and math. Um, so we came up with the STEM diploma. It's very easy to uh, get a STEM diploma, which I think is a great path for anyone, even if you're not thinking of going to the STEM. In order to get a STEM diploma at Holy Angels, you have to take four years of mathematics, four years of science, a minimum of two trimesters of technology courses. You complete a job shadow and engage in two additional STEM-centered activities. I've realized that I can actually become a doctor one of the field trips we took was to watch like a live pig, not dissection, but we got to touch his heart and like lungs and it was still alive and then they tried a new medical device on his heart to see if it could start a heart outside of the body. So being able to touch like something that's still living while they're cutting it open and not being squeamish about it made me realize that I can actually do this. Ready? Ready for really fun? I really like medicine, however, I've tried coding this year and I've realized that's a different potential path for me, so I've gotten to explore things that I would have never imagined exploring. I am one of two college counselors here at the Academy of Holy Angels, and we are unique in that we have a four-year college planning curriculum. We want it to be an exciting time to explore their future and to help them do that. They are make the kids feel so comfortable and they're always available to them. They go above and beyond and they're just insanely helpful with everything. Both Tina and I came from a college admission counseling background. And that understanding of the process around college admission, the terminology, the requirements, what they're looking for, what's happening at the college in terms of the admission process. We have a sense of what that looks like because we've been there. You know, I felt like I trusted that Ben was in Tina Proctor's hands and that she would um, give great advice and be a really good advocate for him with the admissions departments and colleges and, he, and she was. And we get to know them in ninth grade so when we do our meetings in ninth grade with them which sometimes the ninth graders are like why am I meeting with my college counselor when I just picked my high school and I've had families or moms email me after a ninth grade meeting and say we were really struggling to get our student motivated to do homework and after you showed them how competitive it is to get into the University of Wisconsin at Madison he's totally started doing his homework and I'm like hey that's great. I 
I think the importance of the Catholic education at Holy Angels is rooted in values and values that set a foundation for a whole lifetime. For our ninth graders, they'll serve 15 hours in, over the course of the year. And in the sophomore year, it's 20 hours, so it's a little bit bigger expectation. And that's the same thing for juniors and seniors for 20 hours per year, so those expectations as they go up to the year. So by the time they're done at Holy Angels, they have served 75 hours. There is a requirement to do service, but then once you finish your requirement, I found myself, you know, still doing a lot of extra service on top of that. You know, when I think of the blessings that we have here at Holy Angels, Father Mike Tix ranks right at the top. I celebrate all the school masses, uh, but I'm also available at, at different times. I'm here when you, when you need me to be. We do professional theater on the high school level. Theater here is, um, compared to other schools, is way more uh, advanced in its ways where it, uh, it expects more from the actors and the actresses. It's so professional in the way that we're expected to carry ourselves. They will always go to the bar that you set. We set a high bar for the kids, mostly because we set a high bar for ourselves. All of your heads go boom. I saw a play here when I was deciding if I wanted to come here, and it was like the coolest thing ever, and I was like, oh my gosh, that'd be so much fun. Uh, I didn't think that I'd have this much fun singing and dancing. I thought that, you know, it'd kind of be lame, you know, getting up on stage and singing and dancing, but it's the most fun I've had in my life. Too often, the arts are second-guessed in terms of importance in schools. At Holy Angels, they're not. I never really understood at the time what this program would do for me and how it would change me as a person. A visit to the back. We have strong, proud, young people coming out of this organization, and that's what we're most proud of. We preach that you need to play hard, you need to play smart and you need to play together. We actually have 67 sports and activities here. There's something for everybody. Some of my best friends are also my teammates, so we get to like have fun on and off the field. We have strong coaches. They really push us to be the best that we can be. Coaching to me is just an extension of, of teaching, kind of in a different way. If you had any questions, he'd help you through that as well. It was more of a one-on-one -on -one basis if you needed that. If you want to know anything about how you can be better in a sport or how you can excel more, just ask them and they'll tell you exactly how to do it and how to do that while maintaining a good grade point average. They're not just like teaching us the sport, they're also making us better people in general. And so it's kind of nice to have someone that you look up to and um, as your coach. And so you're learning in both in life and on the court or on the field or wherever you're playing. The coaches here, they all buy into that. It's not just your wins. It's not just how good you can play out there. It's all about um, who you are as a person when you leave this school. Having that support really helps me be a better athlete and it helps the team as well. I think what's nice to see is just the wide range of activities that we're having success in. You know, you had knowledgeable in girls basketball, win state, but then you had math team finish second. You had theater, get a star, which is the highest rating you can get at state. Go Stars! It's my house. <laughs>